This is the port of Punta Arenas, a town that sits on the Strait of Magellan and a gateway to Antarctica. It's a place steeped in Antarctic folklore. Legendary figures in polar exploration like Robert Scott, Ernest Shackleton and Roald Amundsen have all been through this small naval outpost on the tip of South America. It's also from where the Turkish Antarctic expedition will begin from. Their mission is twofold. First, scientific. The group will be collecting samples and conducting research to better help the international community understand the ecosystem of the seventh continent and the issue of climate change. They'll also be scouting sites for a possible future permanent Turkish base. But before we depart, there's the training and safety briefings. Most of the group will spend 30 days on a boat as it travels along the Antarctic Peninsula. They'll need to know what to do in rough seas and emergency situations. Not to mention that Antarctica is one of the most inhospitable places on Earth. The first part of our journey could very well be one of the most dangerous parts of the trip. Soon we'll be crossing the Drake Passage, a 1,000 kilometer journey across one of the most treacherous stretches of water in the world. For three days, we'll be smashing through rolling swells and, not to mention, suffering from extreme seasickness. But the journey will be well worth it. At the end, we'll be reaching the stunning mountains, cliffs, and icebergs of Antarctica.